it's not your imagination. Terrorists are launching more attacks like this deadly assault on a Nairobi mall. And it's likely the world will see even more violence next year. CNN obtained exclusive access to an upcoming report from START, a group that tracks terrorism around the world. It found there were 69% more terrorist attacks in 2012 than the year before. There was an 89% jump in deaths. And with well over 5,000 attacks through June of this year, the future looks even deadlier. And I expect we'll see that reflected in even more uh, violence in 2013 and even higher numbers. Dan Benjamin was the terrorism coordinator at the State Department. He says many of today's militant groups judge success by the number of people killed, including civilians. The old red lines, the old barriers are all gone. Six of the seven deadliest groups are affiliated with al-Qaeda, including Afghanistan's Taliban and Nigeria's Boko Haram, which is going after Christian targets. The targeting of other religions or Muslims of a different sect is driving the casualty rate higher. It is much more like warfare, and it's warfare using the tools of terrorism. But the violence is more concentrated than you might think. Three countries, Iraq, Pakistan, and Afghanistan, suffered more than half the attacks and the casualties. Now, the flip side to some of those numbers is what's happening here in the United States. The threat to civilians in the U.S., in Western Europe, even parts of Eastern Asia, actually may be declining, which is good news 